Yo, what is going on YouTube? What's going on everybody, man? Welcome back to the channel. How are you guys doing out there today? Thank you for tuning in. So today we're back here with some more Linda Ronsat. Gonna check it out. You're no good live in Reeling in the Years archives, man. This one was highly suggested on my last video to check out the specific live version of You're No Good. So I'm excited to do that for you guys here today. Thank you for hitting up the comment sections and letting me know where I should go, man. Here we go. Gonna dive in, see what this one's all about. Uh, waste no time. We got 6 minutes, 44 seconds of concert footage, man. So let's dive in, see what's happening, man. Loving the ride with Linda, man. I know she's going to show out right here. Here we go. I'm going to get uh, control of my tongue again and remember how to speak English. I'm going to introduce you to the guys in the band. First of all, on uh, keyboards, Brock Walsh. <laughs> Roddy Wachtel on lead guitar. And of course, my friend Andrew Gold on keyboards and guitars. <laughs> Michael Botts on drums. <laughs> on uh, banjo, harmonica, mandolin, guitar and bass, Kenny Edwards. Wow. And on electric guitar and pedal steel, Dan Dugmore. Rising. 
tears of joy. Hot to the touch, man. Hot to the touch. Oh my gosh. Wow. Guys. They just set that stage on fire, man. They just blew this thing up, man. That was crazy fun. That was a good time. I obviously got so excited, man. I had the tears of joy coming out. Tears of joy coming out, guys. Linda Ron said, you're no good. They just rocked this thing off, man. I'm telling you, that was incredible. The buildup was intense. It was everything I wanted to be. Linda's singing, man. She when she's hitting those deep notes. Oh, she's just like, I don't know what that term is, but it gets a little raspy, a little scratchy, a little uh from from the inside, man. I love it. I love it, man. They rock this thing out right here. Incredible performance by these guys. Everybody, uh, Linda and the group, man. They just slayed. Very fun, man. There's not much more I can say about that. That was outstanding to listen to. You're No Good. I was vibing all the way. Let's learn a little bit about this one. All right, so You're No Good is looking like it was a cover of a D.D. Warwick song released in 1963. So D.D. Warwick released this. The lyric In the lyrics, the singer tells her ex that she's glad they broke up because he's no good. We learn in the second stanza that she also broke up a previous relationship with a man who was gentle and true. In a twist of fate, she would not blame him if he said to her that she's no good, man. So what an interesting twist with the lyrics, man, because you do see that a lot. Well, I've seen a lot where a guy and a girl break up and the guy is typically left to grow in a broken down situation. The girl tends to recover and do better while the guy ends up reali realizing what he lost and if he, only he treated her better. Such a weird dynamic. It happens a lot, though. But then she's honest enough in the story to say she's been that person as well. So maybe it was almost a little bit of karma that came back around. I don't know. But relationships are just, man, relationships are hard. They're hard, right? Um, even me and my wife, we've been together so long, man. You know, uh, teenage sweethearts lovers and stuff and um relationships are hard it's taken a lot of work with us to make it through so i can't judge their situations too much because i just know it's difficult man there's just too much dynamics to really just blame anybody man i don't know things are crazy out there things are i'm glad i'm not in the dating world man that's tough stuff um so you got linda ronsett right here with her version of you're no good being released in 19 74 it says linda ronstadt's version of you're no good became the song's most successful cover the track ascended to number one on the billboard hot 100 chart in 1975 her only song to reach that position you're no good was an international hit for ronstadt reaching number 15 in australia um yeah so there you go with that one man really good stuff one of my favorites from linda the success of you're no good set a precedent for ronstadt's single releases which over the next five years would virtually all be remakes of classic rocks uh rock and roll songs so she found uh a little bit of success here saying well not a lit a lot of success but she ended up just saying hey there's there's kind of a a recipe there that we can kind of deliver on um she just knew hey i could turn these things into just 
versions you've never heard before and you're gonna fall over man so it sounds like she delivered on that so i don't know very dope getting into this one this was just a really great reaction uh to to get into so thank you guys for putting me into your no good with linda ronsat man just the home run right here with her i enjoyed this one man so thank you guys for tuning in unfortunately it's another cover for the cover sometimes i wish that i um uh, knew ahead of time and, and could get a uh reaction to the original stuff um but that's not always the case and just hearing this man I, I really am glad i wasted no time to be honest because this was just crazy good man so i hope you guys enjoyed rocking out with me if you enjoyed the content i produce on the daily basis please consider becoming a member here on my youtube or patreon for as little as three bucks is a great way to support the channel if you're enjoying the content i produce on the daily man don't forget to like subscribe check out the descriptions down below if you're interested in making a donation request all the information you need is down there all right thank you guys so much and i'll see you on the next one Peace.